यू ऑल आर मोस्ट वेलकम इन आवर यूट्यूब चैनल सवाल बवाल आवर क्वेश्चन इज जेड इज इक्वल टू ई टू दावर टू लॉग ई बेस फोर टू दी पावर फोर टू दी पावर टू टू दी पावर जीरो पॉइंट वन टू दी पावर वन पॉइंट वन टू दी पावर वन पॉइंट टू डॉट 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 टिल इन्फिनिटी वी हैव टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ जेड बिफोर यू स्टार्ट टू सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन प्लीज सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल एंड प्रेस द बेलाइकन You can also follow us on Telegram, WhatsApp, and Twitter, which is now known as, known as X. If you have any query regarding any question, or you have any another question, then you can mail us on Sawal Bawal at the rate of gmail dot com. Now let us solve this question. Before solving this question, we should know the concept which are involved in its solution. The first concept which we are going to use is the concept about exponential function. Y is equal to a to the power of x is an exponential function. This function can be divided into two part. when the base is greater than 1 and the base is lie between 0 to 1 now let us analyze its graph when we draw the graph of y is equal to a to the power x when a is greater than 1 the graph look like something this it means when the value of x reaches to minus infinity then the value of y reaches to zero that is y is equal to a to the power minus infinity can be written as zero not approximately equal to zero it tends to zero similarly if you will draw the graph for y is equal to a to the power x when a lie between zero and one the graph look like something uh, something like this that is equal to y is equal to a to the power x by observing this graph we can say that when the value of x reaches plus infinity then the value of y reaches zero that is y is equal to a to the power plus infinity can be written as equal to zero for example we can take a is equal to 0.1 a square of 0.1 can be written as 0.01 0.1 to the power 3 can be written as 0.001 0.1 to the power 4 can be written as 0.0001 clearly you can observe that when we are increasing this number then the value of 0.1 to the power uh, as we are increasing this number the value is reaching tends to zero or becoming smaller and smaller therefore we can say that y is equal to a to the power x tends to zero when x tends to plus infinity this is our first concept second concept which we will use during the solution is any number to the power 0 is equal to 1 that is 2 to the power 0 is equal to 1 3 to the power 0 is equal to 1 similarly 6 to the power 0 can be written as equal to 1 also if you want to prove this then we can write it as 6 to the power 1 minus 1 or 6 to the power 2 minus 2 something like that Then six to the power one minus one can be written as six to the power one into six to the power minus one, and this one can be written as six to the power one divided by six to the power one. It means this will cancel out this one, and that is equal to one. Therefore, we can say that any number has a power zero, then its value is equal to one. This is our second concept, which we which we will use during the solution of above question. third concept is the log formula and first log formula 
इन्वॉल्व इन सॉल्यूशन इज लॉग एम टू दावर एन इज रिटर्न एज एन लॉग एम एंड सेकेंड फॉर्मूला विच विल यूज इज लॉग ए बेस ए इज इक्वल टू वन and third formula is the rotation formula that is e to the power a log e base m is written as a to the power m in this formula we just replace e with m and m with e then it can be written as m to the power a log e base e and log e base e will be written as One, therefore, it can be written as m a to the power, or a into one that is equal to m to the power a. Therefore, we can say that e to the power a log e base m is equal to a to the power m. Now, let us start to solve this question. Our question is z is equal to e to the power two log e base. Four to the power four to the power two to the power zero point one to the power one point one to the power one point two to the power one point three till infinity. If you observe this question, then we can say that the value of one point one to the power one point two to the power one point three till infinity will be equal to infinity. It means. we can write it as e to the power 2 log e base 4 to the power 4 to the power 2 to the power 0.1 to the power infinity and we have already told you that y is equal to a to the power x when x tends to infinity and the value of a lies between 0 and 1 then the value of y tends to 0 it means the value of 0 to the power 0.1 to the power infinity will be tends to 0 it means it can be written as e to the power 2 log e base 4 to the power 4 to the power 2 to the power 0 and we know that any number to the power 0 is written as 1 it means to the power 0 can be written as 1 that is equal to e to the power 2 log e base 4 to the power 4 to the power 1 now it can be written as e to the power 2 log e base 4 to the power 4 now we have another formula that is log m to the power n is written as n log m with the help of this formula we can write 2 into 4 log e base Four. Now it can be written as e to the power eight log e base four. Now with the help of rotation formula, that is e to the power a log e base m, that we have written it as a m to the power a. Therefore, we will replace e with four and four with e. This will equal to four to the power eight. log e base e and it will be equal to 1 that is that is equal to 4 to the power 8 and it can be written as 2 to the power 2 whole bracket 8 and it is equal to 2 to the power 16 therefore z is equal to 2 to the power 16 this is our required solution thanks for watching this solution please subscribe our channel to support us don't forget to like comment and share Thanks once again